Kathy, as a patient, can you discuss personally your worry and concern about receiving your medications based on the current legislation? Absolutely. It's very tough to get things stable. I'm a, currently a home hemodialysis patient and a waiting transplant candidate. So now, trying to keep my anemia in control and my electrolytes in balance and all of the things that I take medications for, if those medications were to change or that I wouldn't have access to them, my health would be unstable. I'd probably be at greater risk for hospitalization. I'm already going through dialysis treatments. That's a kind of a tough enough thing as it is. Um, with the ground shifting underneath me with my medication, it would be very hard to have any quality of life at all, of physical health or well-being. So it's a big deal. And as a waiting transplant candidate, that's, a, that's an even bigger um, challenge because maintaining, you know, there's too few organs being donated right now. To, there's 90,000 people waiting nationally for kidneys. So you can't risk losing a, a transplanted kidney. So it's very important that transplant recipients maintain their medication access. It's a big loss, both in cost and in health.